What's up, everybody? I know the other day you got to see me make bagels. Today, we're going to make sandwich bread, but we're going to add a little twist to it because you need sandwich bread, right? To have bread. Let's get started. All right, to start, you're going to start out with 348 grams of water. To that, we're going to add 250 grams of whole milk. And we heat this up to about 98 degrees Fahrenheit. Once you've got that warm to 98, 100 degrees Fahrenheit, you're gonna add in 18 grams of active dry yeast. You're gonna give that a whisk and let that hang out for about 10 minutes. Next, you're gonna combine 880 grams of bread flour. To that, you're gonna add 16 grams of salt. Next, you're gonna add 42 grams of granulated sugar. At this point, you're also gonna add 23 grams of everything but the bagel seasoning. Give that a whisk. At this point, you're gonna add your flour to the mixing bowl of your stand mixer. Attach your dough hook attachment. Once your yeast mixture has become frothy, turn on your stand mixer and drizzle in your yeast mixture. Occasionally scrape the sides so that all gets incorporated. Once that comes together like this, you're gonna let it go for about two or three minutes until it all stays together and looks pretty. Once you get it to about here, you're gonna add six tablespoons of softened butter, one at a time. Once it's come together like that, and you've incorporated all of your butter, turn your stand mixer off, dump it onto an unfloured work surface. From there, you're gonna fold it, pulling on it until you get a nice, cohesive ball. Then you're gonna place it into a greased bowl. You're gonna cover that with a wet towel in a semi-warm place for about an hour. In this case, we're gonna put it inside of an oven with just the oven light on for about an hour. And after an hour in the oven with just the oven light on, boy, it is two loaves worth of bread. I would say that's doubled in size. I would say you're right. Uncover it, hope to hell the plastic wrap doesn't stick like that. That's not too bad. Lightly flour your work surface. So we're going to take this, divide it in half. And roll each piece out. Roll each piece out so it's just as wide as your pan. Plop that bad boy in there. So you're going to place your loaves into your loaf pans, place an inverted loaf pan over it, and let it rise at room temp for 45 minutes to an hour until it's all puffed back up. In 45 minutes, when it's big and puffed up like this, they're big puffy, puffy boys. When they're big and puffed up like this, take you egg wash, which is one egg and about a tablespoon to two of water. Brush the top lightly. Then after you've brushed them, take, the, take a sharp knife Slit it down the middle. Then pop them into a 350 degree oven for 35 to 40 minutes. And when your timer goes off, this is what you end up with. Let them come to room temp. Getting better every time. You're gonna get one to a loaf? No. Nope. Nope. All right, guys. Two loaves of everything but the bagel bread. It's inside. Egg wash turned out perfect. You got to try this. Anybody order a sandwich? All right, folks. I hope you enjoyed learning how to make these mouthwatering treats at home. If you found this video helpful or simply enjoyed watching, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and hit that subscribe button below for more tasty recipes like this one. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time with another exciting recipe.